Hello, and welcome to another episode of Mr. Kung Has Problems. Tonight in grade five, in module five, we are working on lesson number nine. And that means that we are applying concepts and formulas of volume to design a sculpture using rectangular prisms within given parameters. Very much like what we were doing last time. But in our actual homework, like in problem number one, which is the only problem on tonight's homework, we are doing something a little more modest. We are going to find three rectangular prisms around your house. Describe each item you are measuring, cereal box, tissue box, etc., and then measure each dimension to the nearest whole inch and calculate the volume. So I'm going to go ahead and do that on mine. So I actually found a rectangular prism, and what it is is it's actually some tax software that I bought because we're coming up on tax season here. And I bought tax software, and it shipped in this little box, and it is definitely a rectangular prism. So my, let's see, my item is going to be tax software. Tax software box. And let's see, what is the height of my box? Let's see, I'm gonna stand this up like it would be on a display shelf. Mine is, let's see, seven, eight inches. Looks like eight inches high. And what is the length? Let me go ahead and measure that. Let's see. Well, that is exactly six inches long. And then how wide is it? Oh, well, it's not very wide at all, actually. I'm gonna round that to about two inches wide. And so let's see, now I've got eight inches by six inches by two inches, my three dimensions, eight by six by two. And I think I'm just gonna do that math over here on the side. That's eight inches times six inches. Oh boy, super sloppy again. Six inches times two inches. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's see, that is eight times six is 48 inches squared times two inches. 48 times 2, let's see, oh, that's like 50 times 2 minus 2 times 2, so that'd be 96 cubic inches. My volume would be 96 cubic inches. So I'll just tell you what that looks like. That looks like this, and then it is very shallow. There's my tax software. Tax software, uh, right, it is 8 inches high by 6 inches wide by 2 inches I'm two inches deep, eight by six by two. Awesome. Well, you probably don't have tax software lying around your house. At least I hope you don't. Um, so I'm going to let you find um, rectangular prisms around your house, but you can use this uh, video as a sort of guide at how you might go ahead and do that. So thanks for joining me for another episode of Mr. Kung Has Problems. This is a very brief one. I'll see you again next time. Take care.